guys, how you doing? Hope everything is well, everything is good with me. Yo, let's talk about what's going on out here. Okay, now y'all see that there's more crime with the e-bikes and the scooters and a bunch of other stuff that's going down. We all know that 90% of them is the migrants that's losing their mind because Eric is not even holding them responsible for anything. First, he said that the e-bikes and the scooters were supposed to be registered. Uh, that didn't happen. So now they want to do it again. Like, everything he's saying is, is towards the migrants. Now, we want to know that New Yorkers, what are you going to do for us? Because you, to me, Eric is not fighting for his city, New Yorkers, okay? He got on the news the other day and he said, well, I'm going to keep fighting for my city. Well, listen, no, you're not. You're not. You're not. You're fighting for the migrants. That's who your family is there. Yes, you're migrants. That's your migrants. That's who you're doing everything for. Yeah, we know that you offered them $4,000 to take, to leave the shelter and go find an apartment. Now, you know damn well, damn well, they is not going to freaking go find no apartment with no $4,000 because first of all, first of all, if they leave the shelter with the $4,000, it's not even a voucher, it's $4,000, they could come right back in the shelter again. What you going to say, I just gave you four? You don't even know who they are. You don't even know who they are. No, you don't. No, you don't. Have you ever... Since Adam been here, since Adam been here, I really believe something is going on in the goings and knowns, okay? Because something is about to hit the fan, okay? You know how they say it, th about to hit the fan? Yes, it is, right? So y'all better hold on to your drawers because trust me, we're losing everybody. Everybody is jumping ship out here because I don't know... What the hell is going on? But it stemmed from Eric. Because Eric was the first... For, wait, wait. wasn't Eric. It was the lady that worked for Eric. They, they went to her house and confiscated all the stuff that was in her house. After that, they caught Eric at the airport. Let me get that phone. Okay? He was the first one to get his phone taken. Yes, besides the lady first that lives in his house, that's renting his house or living in his house or whoever. Because I don't know who go with who, who's not going with nobody because the the school commission that goes with the lady that works with him and that's his fiance. this here one. You got Caban and his twin brother, then the other brother. Everybody just doing a, everything. Everybody's falling. Everybody's falling. And it did not happen until... All these migrants got here. I really believe some, it's something behind this here. I don't know what it is, but I'm telling you right now, we are left. Like, seriously, all these new people that's coming in, new commissioners, even a new commissioner, they even got, they even raided his house, the new one. Like, damn, what is going on? Everybody that's connected to Eric is in some type of deep, Water, like, what's going on in New York? I said it before. They really need to clean house. Because this is, the way this is happening out here, it's not right. We don't, we've never been through this here, like, in years. You talking back, 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 way back then, you putting us back there. We didn't have this going on here. We didn't have this going on here. It's something really smelling stink. You understand? Because nothing can happen to the um to the migrants. He's giving money to the migrants to leave to 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 um find an apartment. Not once, not once did Eric say what he's going to do for the ones that he put in these positions. You drop. 
these migrants, you're putting these these migrants in areas where there's already heavy gang members at. So you're just disrespecting our freaking neighborhoods and all that stuff there. And you say, oh, your neighborhood is not off the map for getting my no like no what you mean which what are you talking about right now you're not doing anything for us all we hear every day somebody resigning this one getting fired you got something going on with you you sneaking over to other countries and doing whatever i don't know because it kind of weird to me hoping that you ain't a, you know no mm -mm, because that ain't gonna be right like that's treason i don't know because you're being investigated for you going to these countries and they want to know what you go in there for like who, they your friends or something like they, 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 they your homeboys they they your family or something like that like, I don't know what's going on out here. We are just dangling. We're dangling. That's what we're doing. We're sitting here dangling. We don't know which way we're going. Everything is out of whack here. When I say out of whack, out of whack, we ain't never... I'm telling y'all, I haven't seen this here much stuff going on here in such a long time. It don't make no sense. And then Eric comes out and he says, I'm going to make sure I do everything I can do for my city. No, you're not, Eric. You're doing for the migrants, Eric. That's who you're doing for. You're not doing for us. The things you said you was going to do, you was going to make sure that, you know, because of all the robberies and because of all the stick-ups and all this other extra stuff that's going on, that you was going to monitor it. You're not even monitoring it. And you keep bringing up, yeah, because I'm an ex-cop. Yeah, you're an ex-cop. I hope you remember that. You keep acting like you're still a cop. Like, you're not. You're the mayor. You're the mayor for I don't know how long. I don't know how long because um, it seemed like everybody's jumping ship. Everybody's jumping ship. They could jump ship if they want to because if whatever's going zone out here and it happened when you're behind was here, you're going to jump right back on that ship. Yeah, you're going to jump back on that ship because they're watching. And I wish they would let us know like what's really good you know, going on out here because it's a hot, dirty mess. It's a hot, dirty mess, and it's not fair to us that we have to be put in this position. Not at all. You know, and they say that, you know, Eric know exactly, he's not dumb. Like I said, Eric is from the hood. Eric is straight from the hood, so he can't act like he's not. He knows what's going on, and he's not addressing it, and I don't understand it. I don't understand why he's not addressing it. You understand? He's like, they're here. They're, they're here to have a good life or whatever. What the hell do you think we were here? We were here forever. You never once, Eric said, the ones that's in the shelter, let me try to get them apartment faster. Let me give them $4,000 and try to get them into housing. Let me give them a voucher. Let me do this. You never done that for us ever, ever. No, you haven't. You have never done that for us, ever. We don't even know what, what what's going on with you. You 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 still acting like you know you don't know what's 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 good. And like I said, everybody is jumping ship. Everybody. And it seems like everybody that jump is tied to you. Everybody that's doing this is tied to you. It's something weird that we don't know. You know, we just scratching our head and go now, who's gonna be the next this? Who's going to be the next that? We don't know because they're doing it so quick. It's like boom, 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 boom. Everybody like, then then the, the school commission, he's like, well, I'm going to retire. No. Uh, you know, dog or well, you was not planning on retiring. You was, got you got busted with your so-called 
fiance. When the feds came to your house, they seen homegirl there. They was like, oh my goodness, I was about to go to your house too. You know what I'm saying? They're like, what you doing here? you like, uh, y'all had to make a sub. That's my fiance. Like, what? Y'all don't work together? Like, don't y'all sit right there? <laughs> like, what's going on? And Eric has to know these things. Eric has to know this. Eric has to know it. He has to know it. He is the mayor of this city. And he keep trying to step on toes like the police and all that stuff. He want to ride with the police and coming on and just to get a smoke shop and stuff. No, we're not trying to do that. We're trying to find out who's out here hurting, raping, you know, molesting people, all that type of stuff. Yeah, that's what we want to know what's going on. But you're not saying anything. You, you're smiling as usual. You're smiling, but I don't think anything is funny. To, you know, it's not funny, Eric. It really isn't funny. It really isn't funny. You got the smile on your face. I know, like, you know, you, you, you can smile all you want to, but we, we, we going through it. We going through it. We got people down in the, in, 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 in the trains. We got people stealing trains and crashing them. We got this weird stuff that's going on that haven't been going on. We got stores that's going out of business because they cannot keep up with the, 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 the looting. And not the looting, the shoplifting. Shoplifting is just ridiculous now. But then you say, you say, well, when you have a bunch of men together, what do you expect them to do? Eric, Eric, we been had homeless before the migrants got here, right? We had homeless men that was together. They wasn't doing what they're doing now. So what you, you making excuses for the behavior of them? Shame on you. You're literally making excuses for them. Well, what do you expect them to do when they just sitting around all day? Well, what else? Yeah, you know, they, uh, first of all, if you're trying to help them, why wouldn't you help the other, my, help the other homeless that already was from New York? Why you never tried to help them? Why? Why? See, it's money involved. It's money. All this here is our money. Billions of dollars. Because before, remember, we were going broke. We didn't have no money. We was asking for schools. We was asking for a library to stay open. We was asking for a whole bunch of stuff. And you was like, I ain't got no money. We ain't got no money. But all of a sudden, billions of dollars has been found. Billions of dollars. New schools being built. You ain't had no choice but to build them damn schools when you got all these damn migrants here. You damn right. You got to, You had to. So you acting like you did that for us. You didn't do that for us. You did that for the migrants because they had to go to school. You can't put them all in the hole. It was enough. It was so many of them. They could not fit in these schools. They couldn't fit in it. But we were asking and asking and asking. And it wasn't even done. I don't know what's going on, but I know I'm not feeling comfortable. They said a lot of people is leaving New York because the way it's being run, because everybody here is crooked. They're crooked. Come on. Y'all can't say I'm lying because look how many people resigned so far. Look how many. And look how many is still get, is being investigated. Look how many is being investigated. Look at this. How many is being investigated? I've never in my life heard of this. Even when I was young going to school, I never heard about it. I never heard of a, a whole city resigning. Damn near. People jumping ship. I never heard of it. I, I'm serious. I... Sis, I've never heard of this. Like, for real, I've never, ever heard of this here. I just feel like, you know, New York, I love New York. 
But New York is not the same. You know, I mean, I still, you know, go to the festivals. I went the other day to Chinatown, you know, for the, um, the, the for Italy, you know, the, um, they have the festival for the, um, in, in Italy, Little Italy. I mean, it was nice, you know, but it didn't feel the same. It just doesn't feel the same. You have people where, you know, I go to Queens, I go to Manhattan. You got people out there selling all these here, um, the migrants selling stolen goods in front of everybody's eyes. These are stolen goods. How many stores do you think are going to close up? That's why I'm going to be real with you. We need a heavier hand of mayor that's going to put his foot down to stop this nonsense because the nonsense that's going on right now it's going to ruin us more than we already ruined mm -hmm. you have so many people doing videos joking us out mm -hmm. joking us out like look at this here look at this all our beautiful hotels is a wreck a mess mm -hmm. it's a mess but anyway, I'm just tired of it. I'm just going to listen to the news and see who's going to re resign next. Who are they going to arrest next? Who phone is going to get taken next? We're going to see who's next. Okay? We're going to sit back and wait. Who's going to be next? Because it's so ironic that everybody is tied to Adam. Mm-hmm. It's time to add them. And you know what? Let me just say something. The Caban thing, the commissioners of the... <laughs> Let me just say this here. That is really unbelievable. I would never in my life would have believed a story like this. That a co police commissioner is a twin and his brother would do assignments. Like, wait. <laughs> you, 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 wait. <laughs> I don't feel like going in today, bro. Can you go in? Like, and nobody noticed that that is not him. That's his brother. I ain't even gonna lie. I put a picture up, and I asked, who, which one of them is the police commissioner? Somebody picked the person, and it wasn't him. They picked the wrong person. That's how much they look alike. That's, that's, that, come on, that's crazy. How you do that, though? And you had to know that your brother did it because you wasn't there. If you were supposed to be at work, how did your brother be at work? So both of y'all were standing there? No. That was just so crazy to me. That was really, really unbelievable. That's why he had to go. That's why Kamban had to go because that right there is very dangerous because, I mean, things that they was telling the commissioner that it wasn't for his brother, you know what I'm saying? And his brother was swapping places with him or whatever. That was a lot. And I believe they knew. I believe... <laughs> That they do, they had to, they had to. That's why they was like, "Yo, you, you, you got to go, you, you gotta go." There's no ifs, ands, buts about it. He said he wasn't gonna go, and the next day he was like, "I'm resigning." <laughs> you ain't had no choice but to resign because guess what? You don't understand. Pitches don't lie. Pitches don't lie. I tell people that all the time. Pitches don't lie. Anyway, y'all, I'm gonna go. Hit that like button and subscribe. Y'all tell me in the in the comments how is New York feel y'all. You know what I'm saying? Is New York feel like New York or New York feel like 1988, 1880? Because it don't feel like 2024 to me. Not at all. All right, y'all. Peace.